Well, good morning, everybody. Good morning, everyone. And we're just like the rest of America. We're stuck in our house <laughs> here. Uh, so, guys, we, the vlog still must go on. And I got this uh, 10 terabyte hard drive that I store um, all of our video and all of our extra stuff. Uh, and today um, I found some food reviews that were never released. And uh, a lot of times uh, we, we make videos. Sometimes the videos don't always go, go to plan. In these circumstances, um, these videos were very short, under a minute or two worth of footage. And then they just didn't fit in that day's video or just didn't make it. Kind of got put on the hard drive and um, I don't throw nothing away. So that one day we could use this footage. Um, and well, here's that day, right? So uh, today we have a review on the Black Little Black Bear Cafe in Pigeon Forge. Uh, we did that back in November of 2019, and um, I think it's, we didn't ha we just didn't have enough footage and, and for that video, so it just kind of got pushed off. And then the next we are going to El Paso. Now that video, uh, I was just goofing around. I technically just took a video because we normally eat there, yeah. right? And it was just like you know a Friday night dinner, and I decided to shoot some video, and of course it got you know put off to the side because it didn't fit with anything that day. And so we have a view of those two restaurants. Well, good morning, everyone. And today we're here in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. And we're gonna check out the little Black Bear Cafe, which is actually located right behind Patriot Park here in Pigeon Forge, right? right. Now, we've been here for a long time. They have good breakfast and uh, good lunches here, but we've never, we've never tried it. So, you ready? Ready. Let's do this. So, this place is little. I mean, it's like a like, tiny, tiny little building. I survive a bear claw at the Little Black Bear Cafe. Survived Hollywood. <laughs> Anyways, I got a lot of t-shirts and everything else. Well, here's your menu. Not badly priced. They got omelets. Also, they got salads and soups. They also have some really good sandwiches for lunch. Oh, you definitely have to come back for lunch. Look, they got some really cool sandwiches. I'm uh, at Grizzly Bear. Looks like a good one. They also, it looks like they have a Reuben. I wouldn't mind trying a Reuben and a patty melt. Well, here's my, my omelet. And I had uh, two slices of toast. And what did you get? You got like two eggs. eggs and toast and bacon. All right. Omelet. Well, we just left the Black Bear Cafe. I had the omelet. You had what? You have done? Just the um, breakfast with two eggs and bacon and toast. Yeah. So uh, the price I think cost me about. Fourteen forty for the two breakfasts. Now I'm gonna say a few things. Number one, if you're a big eater, you like big breakfast. The breakfast was kind of small, wasn't yeah. it? They're, I'm still actually hungry a little bit, uh, but it was really good tasting. Yeah. Now I would like to come back and maybe do lunch here because their sandwiches look real good. Um, but yeah, so like I said, if you're a big eater or you know what I mean, you like the big breakfast, uh, definitely not. Well, a Paso Grill is located. Well, right next to Aldi's here in Sevierville. So we're here at El Paso, right? Yep. yep. And they have a little salsa bar. So we're trying different salsas and there's a bean dip, 
and then uh, of course their salsa and their chips are warm and nice and salty they do a real good job here this is one of our favorite places to come to get Mexican right I like trying all the different salsas this one here is like a white one it's really um, got a pleasant taste you know they're yeah, cucumber Okay, so I ordered the fajitas nachos steak. Look at that. Good. And Dawn, you ordered a, a steak quesadilla. Wow. That looks good. It, they're big too, aren't they? They're huge. You got tomatoes and onions and green peppers. And uh, steak, look at the steak. I should have said to go easy on the sauce, but they put way too much on there. A lot of sauce, just huh? Too much. Yeah. I don't like it dripping in them. I like the little, I don't really have it on the drier side. So, wow, uh, those are two restaurants here in the Smoky Mountain area. Of course, we love El Paso, um, and we also like Cancun. There's a bunch of Mexican local restaurants that we uh, frequent. Uh, they're all pretty much similar. Uh, prices can differ depending on where you're at. But uh, yeah, so um, now what we're going to do is we're going to leave you guys with um, actually uh, Tony5000, our friend Tony5000, sent us a bunch of goodies uh, from New Orleans. And I had this video and it just never made it nowhere because it didn't seem to fit in the Smoky Mountains. But right now we're going to leave you with a king cake and um, some some... Uh, desserts that he, he he gave us well our good friend Tony 5000 uh, he's actually from Louisiana New Orleans and he actually we got to meet him the other night and we got these they call pedophores and these ones are really cute in fact they're so cool looking that you don't even really want to eat them look at the look at that witch isn't that hilarious and this this ghost over here or check out the the eyeball but anyways they were really cool also tony said that i've never had it before but he gave us a a king cake well there she is and boy we took it out of the bag and it the smell of cinnamon this is technically a big cinnamon roll i have never had king cake <laughs> Alright guys, so go ahead and cut this cut cut yeah just Where start do I start in the middle? Yeah, just start in the middle. I don't want to cut the baby. Where's the baby? <laughs> Where's the baby? Is, is that big enough? enough? Um yeah. You know there's a chance that nobody's gonna get a baby the first maybe, time around. Maybe. Where's the baby? So there's a guaranteed baby in there? Yeah, there's okay. a baby somewhere in there, guys. I think he's right there. <laughs> you think he's there? I think he's right there. <laughs> Whoever gets the baby. Or right there, it looks pretty more puffy. Where's that baby? Mm, baby. Where's baby Jesus? Where, where's, where's that where's that movie, uh the Labyrinth you like to watch? Yeah. The baby baby. What's that song? Oh the uh, dance baby dance. Dance magic, baby dance. dance magic dance baby dance. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all baby, the ooh. Baby, baby, baby. <laughs> Guys, no So you guys are just no mad you guys are looking for the baby? Yes. There's no baby in there. I told you he's right there. So the baby's on this side, huh? The baby's over there. Yeah. Somewhere. What do you want those little pedophores? They are so cute. They're too cute to eat. Too cute to eat. <laughs> okay, Sierra, so you got the eyeball. That's actually a pretty, pretty cool one. What'd you get? You got the witch? I got the witch. The witch. You got the ghost. You got the ghost guy, right? Yeah, she's really cute. I got a, a pumpkin dude. And Dad's playing his um, music real loud in the background here. And, um... <laughs> <laughs> and then mom's got a pumpkin guy too, so okay right, guys, well let's try these pedophores. Uh oh. You wanna try them? I've never had one of these before. No, I've never they're, they're so cute. A French pastry is what they are. And they're so cute. I don't know if I want to eat her though. It does taste like um got a orangey flavor, a lemon flavor? Mine tastes orange. Yeah, like orange, orange, yeah. It's, it's fluffy like a, like a wedding cake. Yeah, yeah it's um... Mm -hmm. 
And then tonight's live stream, it is very good. we're is going, it good? we're going to share these with our, with our oh. audience. And we all had, we, we pretty much polished off the, um, and guess what? Nobody's got the baby. So the baby has got to be <laughs> there. In there. We'll probably get it tonight during the live stream. <laughs> I recommend this. This is really good. Yeah. I'm not good. a cake person, and I really do like it. I like it. It's good. You like it? I don't know. It's hard to describe. It's just good. Well, guys, that was our clips that didn't make it in the main videos. Guys, I have literally probably hundreds. I got enough for probably weeks of this. Um, some are bigger than others, and so there, some are more um, uh, like vlog style. These are just like odds and ends. So, guys, if you like this vlog... Give it a thumbs up. Also, if you haven't, please subscribe so you don't miss these upcoming well uh, looks back into the Smokies and our adventures. And until next time, everyone. Thanks for watching. Good night, everyone. Hey, everybody.